Hey guys, how you doing? It's Henry at Motors and Blowers. Welcome to another weekend product review. Today I'm reviewing another product from my friends over at Vivor. Uh, as you guys know from the link in the description, I review a lot of Vivor products. Uh, they sponsor the channel by letting you guys know through me what great products they have on their website, vivor.com. It'll take you two hours just to look through it, and I'm guaranteeing you, you're going to buy something. Very good value for what you're getting. Let's open this up right now and see what it is. It's a lawn sweeper in the fall here on the East Coast. Leaves fall from our trees, and it completely covers our lawn. It's one of the biggest pains in the butts that happen yearly. If you don't have a lawn tractor with a bagger system or at least a push mower for smaller yards with a bagger system, are you raking leaves with your hands and a rake and bending over and picking them up and putting it into a bag? <laughs> Work smart, not hard. This is a push lawn sweeper. It picks up leaves and debris that's on your lawn. <laughs> or maybe your driveway. <laughs> Let's put it together really quick and see how it works. So there you go, didn't take very long. You saw, I did read the instructions because it wasn't obvious. I don't usually use instructions because it's obvious where it goes. This was not so obvious and I didn't want to waste time by putting it wrong, so I read the instructions. Not all of it, just looked at the diagrams. It's very easy. So the bagger has these two rods that go through, they clip onto here and an elastic thing that clips right onto the hook over here. You have to make sure the hook was pointed in the right direction on the inner side with these wing tip type bolts on there uh, and nuts. And uh, it's very cool actually. Uh, look at the size of this bag. Um, seven bushels, I believe I read. And basically it's a four brush, four brushes, bristle brushes on an axle onto the wheels. Wheels are rubber wheels, uh, pretty good size, like 10 inch. Uh, you guys can read the uh, <laughs> link in the description if you want the details, but it looks like a 10 inch rubber wheel, uh, four bristle brushes, you know, like a broom brush, vinyl or nylon, and it rotates on an axle, and it only rotates backwards, counterclockwise, I'm sorry, clockwise, well, counterclockwise if you're on that side. <laughs> and if you pull backwards, it doesn't. So it only engages the axle by spinning, pushing forward. As you can see here, there's a wingtip nut that allows you to adjust the height. So this is very low, meaning that the bristles will actually scrape the ground. So if you're doing sweeping, such as your driveway, <laughs> which I definitely need to do because my driveway is in terrible shape, let's keep it on low. Depending on how tall your grass is on your lawn, you would adjust to high or middle, whichever you decide that works better picking up the leaves. As you can see, we're in the middle of summer right now. So the leaves are still on the trees. Nothing's fallen except for some nuts, shells from the squirrels in the trees. And they're covering my entire driveway. I do have a little bit of debris over there, which we'll try in a minute. 
I'm transporting it like this because it doesn't sweep the ground backwards. So I have it on the lowest setting and for your lawn, it would be too low. So you couldn't even really push it because the bristles are hitting the ground. So what I'm gonna do is let's try the driveway. As you can see from my driveway, it is disgusting. It has nutshells from the squirrels from the tree and a lot of debris. Okay, I'm gonna try the driveway. I mean, it's meant for the lawn, but okay, what's the difference, right? <laughs> oh. Driveway. The driveway. Okay, check this out. Look how disgusting my street is where I park my truck. Disgusting. I'm gonna have to try to sweep that up. Check out how clean that is. You can't get the crevices there, so you may need a blower to blow that stuff out and then pick it up. But it really did a great job, just like four passes. Really cool. Here we have some leaves and debris on the lawn. So obviously you have to do it to high. The grass is somewhat long here. I'll put like three quarters. See how that works. Dump it. Lift it up. Dump it in the back. Super easy. So if you didn't have a lawn tractor with a bagger attachment to it, and you're still raking leaves, I guarantee you this is going to cut your work in half. This is the Vivor, 26 inch wide lawn sweeper, but you could also use it 
to sweep your driveway and your road. I don't think my road has ever been so clean in this area. Easy to bag, easy to discharge the stuff that you've just picked up. Really lightweight, smooth pushing, as well as rubber wheels for good grippage. And it worked just great. I'm pretty surprised. Uh, I could use this for my street all the time. Like I said, another great product from Vivor. Go check them out. I'll leave a link in the description if you guys want one. Also, go check out all the other Vivo products that I've uh, reviewed in the past. You're going to love them. They're also in the link in the description. We'll see you guys all next time on Mowers and Blowers.